If you want insane deals on legit PC keys from great developers, use my fanatical link down below and start saving yourself some money. What's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Guys, today I'm here to talk about a new early access game called Hunting Fields of Jackals. <laughs> is being made by the guys at Squat9. It came out today, April 15th, 2019. The description on the store page is drive various uh, <laughs> drive various of real-world military vehicles that armed with real-world heavy weapons, racing and fighting against other players in a unique PvP plus PvE survival mode. So here we go. Hi, dear player. You are now playing the early access version. Some of features may not active yet make sure you read the gameplay guide page before matching games if you find anything wrong or bugs you're very appreciated get contact with me you can find links in the credits page also any suggestions are surely welcome good luck all right let's go press to continue okay here we go here we go Ooh, i was wondering when the noise was gonna come when the loud music was gonna start okay oh god yeah here comes the loud yeah oh yeah uh does that be general settings? No. Graphic settings. There's no audio settings. Fucking really? All right, no audio settings. That's cool. Uh, let's go the tutorial first. Oh, new music. Uh, training mission. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, oh, all right. So do I, do I control the vehicle? I do. I do control the vehicle. Okay. Morning, soldier. We know that you might be an experienced warrior already, but wars are varies from each other. <laughs> but wars are varies from each other. Here's something you still need to know before the transporter take you to the battlefields were much worse. You might need to take this mission first in order to get yourself fully understand all essential tactical operations. When your vehicle is fully stopped, the S key gives you backward, otherwise it breaks. The gear states will be displayed on top bar instead, besides the space key uh, corresponds to the handbrake. Okay, now let's skip to the next one. Let's go first check. Okay, okay, I'm going really, really, okay. Things are, okay, slow motion. You have five camera views, okay. So v is switching between them. Oh, oh God. Okay. Love that frame rate. Okay, so. Oh, this is another view. Oh, that's my ADS view. Got it. The fucking vehicle control is terrible. <laughs> it's so bad. Okay, here we go. We got we got enemies. Oh god. It's so hard to control. Wait, what? Wait, I'm stuck. I'm not even shooting. <laughs> I wasn't even shooting. Hold on, is there bullets? Okay. Hold on. Where are my bullets? Wait. So I have bullet impacts there. So, okay. So when I fire, it only displays one bullet at a time. If I'm single firing, look at, but if I hold it, no, no, we don't need any more bullet uh, impacts. No, no, no. So is he going to aim automatically for me? All right. That's a big fucking solid. No. 
Woo! No, I'm dead. Okay. I just saw a copy on all. Out. Why is the fucking vehicle so slidey? Oh, Lord. All right. So he apparently doesn't shoot at all. Oh! <laughs> okay, yeah. Awesome. Okay, just quit. Yeah, just... Are you sure you want to quit? Yeah, there you go, for fuck's sakes. Number of players, 20 players? Wait, it's an online game? <laughs> oh yeah, P right, PvP plus PvE. So start matching, let's see. Oh wow, there's people playing? Hunting fields of Jackal. Oh god, not this fucking thing. All right, here we go. Okay, can already shoot. Awesome. God damn, this game is loud, man. So it's like a very terrible twisted metal. Oh, <laughs> oh my. I fucking hate this game already. What is going on? Literally can't even see the vehicle. I only hit the target once? Oh, I'm out of, am I out of ammo now? Wait, am I out of ammo now? I'm out of ammo now. Holy fuck, bro. Yeah, that's right, bitch! Hit target, minus 100. Are you dead yet, bitch? I don't get the fucking, the health. What? 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 Okay, 30 seconds, okay. Oh shit. Wait, what kind of fucking vehicle is that? Am I dead? Yeah, man, fuck all this shit, dude. This game is fucking trash. The game is just so, like the controls are so gross that like you can't even barely control the fucking Humvee that you're driving. It's just god awful. Uh, let's take a look at the Steam store because apparently this is an actual game that people worked on. Hunting Fields of Jackals. So why early access? As a member of the independent game developers, <laughs> oh my god. This solo made game is probably one of the most independent ones. What does that even mean? In order to achieve excellent quality while maintaining the game and adding more features, I hope to draw as much advice as possible from the players before the 1.0 version goes online. The current version contains the most important core features and playing mechanism of the game and also provides uh, uh, quite a number of vehicles and weapons. And we will provide more content in the 1.0 version, more interesting vehicle weapons and more terrain maps. I hope that players from the community would like to contribute valuable suggestions and inspirations to make this game more exciting and interesting. I'm not gonna lie, the premise of the game actually seems kind of cool. Like a like a deathmatch type battle royale type like racing game all com combined into one. I think that's a pretty cool premise. The execution on the other hand, uh, just absolutely god awful. Approximately how long will this game be in early access? More armored vehicles and weapons and terrains are being produced. I hope that these contents will be added to the 1.0 version within six to 12 months. Then there will be more time to learn from the player community and ingest players opinions in these months. So from from what I'm gathering, they're looking at a year, six six months to 12 months, so about a year. They're developing more vehicles and weapons. I don't think that's the problem. I think the problem is just the game itself is just not good. Um, how's the full version plan to differ from the early access version? So you're gonna have more vehicles, more weapons, more maps, vehicle pa painting customization, the twin player mode, two players on the same vehicle, and a team player mode. They just, the, Content's not, content's not the issue. The game just felt absolutely awful. <laughs> awful to play. 
Will the game be priced differently? God, I hope it's cheaper. We will increase the price of the game as we complete new features and eventually leave early access. The early buyers will also be rewarded by some limited in-game items as special gifts. So it's currently $20. Hopefully when the game comes out, it's, it's worth a shit. Um, because personally, I don't think it's worth $20 at this point. I don't think it's worth 15 or even 10, maybe five. I, I just, I don't know, man. The real fucking kicker here is we got an update on the 20th of March. We plan to release this game on April 15th. Now it goes on to say after three years of hard work, the first version is finally ready to be revealed to the world. We are squat nine an indie game studio. Actually, there's only one full-time working developer at this moment, which is me. But during the development, many fans and players have been taking part and provided lots of support and suggestions. Um, it took three years to get here. The main point of the game is racing and vehicle control. And there's really little to none of that. The game is so slidey. The vehicles aren't weighted or grounded at all. What took three years here? Like, I get that you're one guy, but I mean, I'm I'm not seeing it myself. Considering the fact that, like, you can't even leave the vehicle, so it's basically just, that's your controller. You can switch between different camera angles and then control the gun. There's nothing else here outside of the networking, I guess, to get 20 players in a match or 50 players I saw there as well. I'm I'm super confused. This makes me... Like, really question how long it's actually going to take, or if it does take 6 to 12 months, and let's say you release it after a year, what's the, uh, what's the quality gonna be like on 1.0 launch? The premise and the idea of the game is cool, the execution is very mediocre at, at just absolute best. And as always with these early access videos, I usually give you guys a first impression. I jump in, play a few games, try to get you the gist of what the game is, where the game is, the quality of the game, and Hunting Fields of Jackals really just misses every single <laughs> every single mark. Um, if you guys want to check it out, the link is going to be down in the top comment below. I'm going to start doing that. I had some, some feedback from you guys. If you want to check out the games, even though in this case, this isn't the worst game I've ever played. But like in other games, even though they are like super terrible and I can't imagine anybody actually buying them, um, you guys still want the, the links in the descriptions or, or the top comment. So I'm going to do that there. Leave a comment down below and let me know what you guys think of this. Um, <laughs> I'm just watching the, the gameplay trailer here. It's just ass. Anyways, guys, my, my name is Big Fry. I appreciate you guys watching. If you enjoy the content, make sure you are subbed to the channel. And if you guys could, share these videos on social media. Leave the likes and all that stuff. It helps the channel. Helps get the exposure out. And it, it feeds the YouTube algorithm. I appreciate you guys for watching. My name is Big Fry. And I'll see you on the next one. <laughs>